Welcome to PCMRP's video tutorial series. The purpose of this video is to provide an overview of PCMRP's routing module, which could also be called a traveler module. The purpose of a router module is to track the sales or work orders as it travels through manufacturing. Before I can track a sales or work order through manufacturing, I must first issue a sales or work order to the manufacturing. So I'll select modules, stock room, and new. I will select I to issue the sales or work order to manufacturing and hit the OK button. I'll hit the OK button twice more and click on yes, there is a sales or work order for these items. I'll select sales order 104 and hit the OK button. I'll select to issue from stores, issue parts automatically, assemblies if available, display, and press the OK button. If there are multiple items on the sales order, this screen would allow me to select which line items should be issued. Since the sales order only consists of one line item, and it is already checked, I'll press the OK button. PCMRP displays the pick list of the parts to be issued to, to the manufacturing floor. I can print the pick list by selecting Print, and selecting my printer, and pressing OK. Now that the job has been issued to manufacturing, I can now start to track it with PCMRP's routing module. I'll select Optional, Router, and enter movement. The first thing I will do is scroll and look up the sales order that I just issued to the manufacturing floor. Here we can see sales order 104 line item 0001. It is sitting at the first work order station known as Kidding. Later on in this video I'll show you how to assign names to each of the workstations. I will move five of the assemblies from Kidding to the drilling workstation by selecting the drilling area. I'll enter at 5 as the quantity to move and press the move button. As you can see, 5 are now left in kitting and 5 can be found in drilling. I can display or print the router by clicking on the output button. Here you can see your router or traveler for this sales order. If I wanted to see where all my sales or work orders are on the manufacturing floor, I would select optional, routing, and reports. I will select all records display and press the OK button. Here we can see all the sales or work orders for and which workstations they are at. I will hit the X button and cancel to return to PCMRP's main screen. To give my workstations names I would select optional, routing, and settings. Here I can enter the name of my various workstations such as shipping. Well I'll press the cancel button and return back to PCMRP's main menu. I hope I've shown you how PCMRP's routing module can help your company efficiently manage your manufacturing floor. Thank you.